vain. In vain do they worship me. It's a waste of time. I love the church in Brooklyn called the Brooklyn Tabernacle with Pastor Jim Cimbala and his wife Carol who leads their choir, 280 voice choir. Such an awesome story how God took that little church that started so many decades ago uh, where Jim became the pastor and it was just a dying church and they had uh, eight or 10 people in the choir and how God has taken that and used that church and used that choir all over the world. Well, one of the things that Carol said when I was at a conference there, she said, you know, we get calls quite often and people will ask if the Brooklyn Tabernacle Choir will come and perform for us. And she said, I always tell them the same thing. No, we don't do that. We don't perform. This isn't a performance choir. We worship the Lord. That's what we do. This isn't about performing. See, here's, here's what happens when you perform. And especially when a choir performs. When a choir performs, everything is horizontal. You come to watch them perform. And they're performers. And they sing the songs and they do the things. And then you clap for them. We don't want that in church because church is about vertical. We're here for an audience of one. And that is God. And so everything that the choir does is to uh, lift us up and lift our head up to the one of whom we're worshiping, the one that we offer our worship. And I love that about the Brooklyn Tabernacle. We don't perform. We're not performers. We worship the Lord. And God has so blessed that. Listen, worship is not about performing. It's not about going through the motions. You know, you, it's a love relationship. And just like in marriage, if you try to perform for your spouse, if you say the right things, but your heart is disengaged, if you honor your spouse with your lips, but your heart is far away from your spouse, pretty soon your spouse figures it out. Hey, you're checked out. You're just saying things. You're just, this, this just isn't real. And then nobody wants that kind of relationship, a check-the-box marriage. People want a loving relationship. God wants that too. So it's not about a place, and it's not about a performance.